everybody, Ben here with We Go Fishing, and welcome to a product review for Legend Popping Corks. These popping corks, they've been around in Texas for a long time, and the manufacturer sent me some of them, and I want to show you what we're looking at here for these popping corks. You can get them in a lot of different stores in South Texas. If you can't get them in South Texas, I'll put a link to their website also in the description below and on the video in the lower third here in just a moment. I'm also going to be showing you how they look in the pool so that you can get a better idea of how these popping corks work and there are a couple of different ones the first one is the heavy hitter and you can hear that it's got a really nice sound and uh, these are made plastic and uh, really indestructible I mean you could stand on I wouldn't recommend it but you can stand on them um, and they should hold up pretty well that's the heavy hitter there's also the midnight rodeo uh, which also has a very nice sound the one that I'm gonna be testing out in the pool um, is just uh, the one that I have rigged up here. It's the Legend, and you'll hear this one in the pool when we go out there in just a moment uh, to show you how these look underwater. They also have a glow-in-the-dark version of their popping corks, which is very interesting, uh, very cool. If you are on piers and you're fishing at night, uh, that glow is going to help attract those fish as well. So uh, they have four different versions. Again, if you can't get them in a store near you, make sure you check out their website. We are going to be rigging them up a couple of different ways. Uh, the first way that we'll see is one that's very standard and typical, rigged underneath the popping cork. Uh, we're going to be doing it with uh, simulation. This is not a live shrimp. Karen won't let me have live shrimp in the pool. Um, but this is an artificial uh, lure rigged up like we do typically through the horn of the shrimp and also with a um, with a small little split shot here at the top of the hook. Uh, that was one thing the manufacturer said that would help with the rigging of these. And the second way that we're going to do that is with a paddle tail on a um, weedless setup here with a twist lock, uh, owner twist lock, and we'll get that rigged up and we'll pull that through the pool and show you how that works as well. Let's get out there. I'll show you how these things look. So there you saw those uh, popping corks and how they sat in the pool, how they looked in the pool. I will say I really like the action of that paddle tail underneath that popping cork. Um, that fall was really nice and I think that would really uh, provoke the fish. Um, and that the sound of it in the water was also very good. So make sure you check out uh, these popping corks. Like I said, if you're in South Texas, you can get them at local retailers. Uh, their website does have a list of all locations you can get them. If you're not in South Texas, or a place where these popping corks are available, you can order online as well. Check them out. I think that you'll like them. And until next time, may you always catch your limit.